Well, welcome back to my Wind on Animal Planet. This is part two, and in this part, I'm going to wind on two shows, Rattlesnake Republic and uh, Man Eating Super Snake. Now let's start with the first one. Well, the first one first, okay? Rattlesnake Republic. I just watched a clip of this show, and I have to say this. Shame on Animal Planet for glorifying some of the most cruelest animal cruelty things of the world. This is animal cruelty, and they're glorifying cruelty to rattlesnakes. And none of the animal animal rights organizations like PETA and, H and HSUS are doing anything about it. Seriously, why aren't they doing anything about this crap show? That shows abuse to rattlesnakes and glorifies an abuse industry. The rattlesnake roundups, which in my opinion needs to go away for good. Oh yeah, I forgot. Both of these groups don't care about animals at all. And just care about their own greedy, greedy pockets. This show represents the first show, in my opinion, which glorifies fear of snakes. Well, maybe not the first, but this show glorifies the propaganda that HSUS and Peter gives you. It makes the propaganda look like true info, which it's not, okay? It's not true info at all. It's not even educational. This show has no educational value whatsoever. It is absolutely worthless. And it shows cruelty to animals. This is the only show, in my opinion, that shows and glorifies animal cruelty. Are you serious, Animal Planet? Glorifying this show which shows animal cruelty in it. Are you serious? Oh wait, I forgot. You in there for the money making now. So good shows don't matter don't matter all that much to you anymore. So bottom line, this show just sucks. Okay. The the value of this show is this show is zero and I hope it gets cancelled. I hope this show gets cancelled eventually. Because if it does get cancelled, I will be glad the day it gets cancelled. Because this is crap I don't want to see. Ever. Okay. Now let's go to the second show. Man Eating Super Snake. Uh, I remember seeing this show earlier this year. And I had to say, I immediately recognized that documentary was propaganda, another propaganda film. It's kind of like Rattlesnake Republic. They're both fear mongering and they're both making snakes out to be these evil ugly creatures like killer aliens from 2009, okay? Killer aliens, Rattlesnake Republic, and this show, Man Eating Super Snake. They all demonize reptiles, okay? And they all make snakes look like evil, ugly monsters. When in fact, snakes are not the monsters here. People are, people are killing snakes for sport, for pleasure, out of ignorance and fear. That's not funny. Not funny at all. So, man eating super snake, they're both demonizing pythons. Okay, and and snakes in general, they'll make snakes have to be these big, ugly, man-eating machines, which is absolutely false. And all the theories about snakes being evil are nothing but fab, fab, fab or mythical or fabric fabricated garbage. Okay, all the all the all the things about this show, in other words, this show is saying snakes are evil, ugly monsters. 
just like the other three shows. This show, Rattlesnake Round, Round, or should I say, Rattlesnake Republic, and uh, Killing uh, Killer Aliens. All three are saying that snakes are evil, ugly monsters, which they are not. The myth of snakes being evil, ugly monsters is a myth, okay? A myth. Okay? So, bottom line, man eating super snake sucks too. Both of these shows suck. Okay? They suck so badly that they have no education, educational value whatsoever. I'm beginning to lose my faith with Animal Planet now. They just have so many crappy programming on that it's not worth watching. I miss the old Animal Planet. Animal Planet, I lost hope in you. I'm laying out of 21 and I'm shining out. I'm going to watch my two leopard geckos, Manny and Na.